Welcome back to my channel, everyone. It's your skin red fox coming back with another episode of Let's Play Crusader Kings 2, the Leon edition. All right, so the first episode was extremely active. Um, we actually got a lot done in that first episode, as you can tell. We took over the two near um the two uh brotherly kingdoms of Castile and Galicia. Leon has expanded quite nicely, and as you can tell, Aragon and Navarra had taken a little bit of land for themselves as well. So that's pretty um interesting in and of itself. Now our main objective as of the current state of the game is to make sure that we can defend ourselves against the rest of the um the uh, Spanish uh, Muslims, so that way maybe that we can actually have a pretty good chance of fighting them a little bit later on. We need to try to like save up as much as we can. Right now we have no heir, which is, which is an issue, but we do have a wife, she is 29, and we are going to probably try and deal with um, actually getting a uh, wife now. We don't really have to worry about stewardship at the moment, as we do not have enough dom uh, enough provinces to really fill up our domain anyway. So, getting a few of them really does not um, getting a little bit extra stewardship is not really going to make a heck of a lot of difference right now. Our main objective right now needs to be to actually like obtain as much gold as possible, so that way that maybe we can actually like push for something a little bit later on. Hold on, do I leech clever? I have, um, Okay, cool, whatever, that's fine. Hmm, so I've been excommunicated from the church, which is... Hmm. 25 piety, oh, that's unfortunate. Need to go ahead and legitimize her. So it looks like the daughter is still sickly, which is a little disappointing, but whatever, that's fine. We'll uh we'll make do with what we have for right now. We go ahead and send to this guy over here, Constantinople, and hopefully we can keep on raising whatever we can over there. Um, wow, that's impressive. In fact, this guy's got 17 already. Keep just, I'm just gonna get the best that I can at the moment. Uh, the biggest problem is that we actually just don't. Hmm. Problem is, is we're excommunicated, and apparently we cannot actually lift the excommunication, which is a little bit of a problem. We not like send a gift. I imagine the gift has to be yeah. It's, the gift has got to be huge. So, mm. okay. It's a little bit of a problem because he. Hmm. We'll leave it be for right now, because it's not that big of a deal, honestly. The Holy Roman Empire is quite big, so we do have to be kind of careful for all that kind of stuff right now. I feel like mo... Ugh. Let me see, what is the tax shift that she uh, imposed? Um, I didn't even see, honestly. Uh, more more gold from the church than actual troops, whatever, that's fine. I'm not too worried about that, honestly. How many troops does this guy have? Three thousand, wow, he's got three thousand in just that little bit, that's pretty impressive. I'm actually surprised that most of our council doesn't want to do anything to help us here. <laughs> I couldn't even keep a straight face when I said that. So it looks like a bunch of people are trying to kill me. I don't know who it is actually at the moment, which is a little bit of a problem, but we will try and fix that here in a second. I 
Ah, that's what it is, Popple Investiture. Um, it was free, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. Well, I should no longer be excommunicated, which will improve my standing with most of my people, so that's good. Hmm. I want to see something. Who is this? Um, hmm. I need to like try and get uh, as many people as I can that actually like me in the. Um, and seats of power here. Let's see, will that actually like help me out a little bit? Actually it will, wow. So that's what we're gonna do here. All right, now we can actually go back and re uh, reallocate all this stuff right here. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're gonna raise up our um, all the levees right now should take us just a minute. It shouldn't take us long here. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Why are we like, why are these guys like traveling so fast? Ugh, it's aggravating. Go ahead and let them lose their little battle right now. Want to be done with? Oh, that's not good. We lost a ton of troops right right off the bat. We need to just slow siege that. Don't need to assault the holding right now. It's a little bit too much. Hmm. It's a little slow, but I mean, we we got it, so that's fine. should be able to win this battle pretty easily I think no we didn't actually wow that's pretty astounding do we not have um only thing you think of is that we don't have commanders that's about that's about right oh that's not good um let me see do we have any holy orders no we don't wow we don't have holy holy orders this early I mean this late oh this is not good either we're about to start getting pounded by uh different battles here um Except that, yeah, we need some, like, actual help in these battles now. We're going to have a few issues. Um, how much gold are we getting? Six gold a month, so we can actually still, like, get a mercenary band together here. Who actually went against us? Oh, that guy just left. Okay, that's fine. Court Jester, it's fine. Master's fine. High Almoner, Cup Bear. Okay, so now what we need is to find a very cheap mercenary band. Sounds good to me. That'll work. Need to borrow the 300 just to make sure that we actually have enough here. So we have enough daughters here. Maybe we can actually like try and actually get some alliances here maybe. Uh, whatever, that's fine. Okay, whatever. We'll make do with that for now. Hmm. 
Hmm. Maybe he's actually got like a son or something. Ooh, there we go. Uh, let's see. Do we have anything that we can actually, like, do here, maybe? I'm trying to see. Like, it says that he's, like, going to marry into the dynasties and stuff, which is a little bit aggravating because it doesn't seem like we should be marrying into the same dynasties. Like, that'd be kind of weird if we were, like, actually, like, that closely... Related with everybody. Hmm. Let me see. Brittany, maybe? Maybe they have something here? Nah, he's got someone already. That's aggravating. Hmm. <laughs> Who can we actually marry our kid off to here? That's the question. I'm gonna try and see if they've got anything anywhere close, but hmm. Maybe Poland, I guess. Let me see. Does he have someone? Yeah, he does. Hmm. Ah, he's a friar. Oh, that's what it meant. Like, it meant that. Okay, I see what it was. It wasn't that we would be of the same house. It would that it would be because of, of that they. Ju it's just that they just refuse. It's not because of that. What I thought it was. That's fine. That makes a little bit more sense than the latter did. So these guys are actually defending against two wars right now. So. It's kind of aggravating that they actually, um, all right, so let's try and get some of our own, like, troops to actually, like, be in here, I mean, some commanders to actually be in here, because I actually forgot to do that for the last battle as well, although I don't think it would have made any difference, to be fair, so. So we're just losing every battle that we're going into, and I'm not exactly sure why. It doesn't seem like we're actually, like, doing that poorly, but, hmm. So it looks like this one we're just going to have to surrender. It doesn't look like we have much of a choice against that one. Yeah, we're going to lose a ton of gold, and we actually lost our own guys here. Wow, now they're actually wanting to come now. That's actually kind of funny. I guess they realized it was as bad as what it was, because if we actually lose this war, it's pretty bad for the Christian faith, because we're actually going to be a quite a huge deficit. Oh wow, it actually didn't fully siege it. That's that's so crazy, like how the sieges are so much harder once you get this further up. 
Are we gaining troops per month? Oh yeah, we're gaining a ton of troops per month. Okay, so we're good. We can actually just sit here and wait then. I'm not too worried about that at the moment. Alright, so let's see here. We're going to need our own commanders here to be actually available. wonder if they'll actually like go and help me out with this battle. I doubt it. Hey, they actually did. Wow, look at that. So if you actually order them to sit in your... If you actually ask them to sit in your in your um army, they'll actually help you with this. So that's pretty interesting. The thing is, I really don't want to have to deal with this war, but the guy is like literally about to win, and if he wins, I'm in a pretty bad spot because these guys will immediately swallow him up before I get a chance to. And I don't really feel like dealing with that, so. It's just enough aggravation to aggravate. I mean, it's just enough to aggravate me. Oh, that's nice. Get a little bit of gold back at least. We're actually getting a lot of gold back now. We're almost back to where we were before. Except, come on. Make sure that we have all the possible troops here that we can. I don't even know what this is. Like this Zamora? It's kind of weird. I don't know exactly what that is, to be honest with you. Go ahead and we'll attack this guy. We'll take our provinces back pretty swiftly. Go ahead and give her that. Okay, whatever. Not too worried about that at the moment. Okay, we're almost back to where we were before. Am I still fat? Hmm, I am still fat. And this episode's a little bit different than the last episode in, in the sense that we're actually like on the back foot a little bit here. I'm actually kind of surprised that we actually went so far in like not really so much like a cowardice type way, but like we're definitely like more sketchy on what's going on. Another daughter, no sons yet, which is very interesting. Well, we can go ahead and get a patrol off here. Let's go over here and let's do that. Hey, we actually got another alliance, which is pretty nice. Where's he at? He is way over there in Denmark. Nice little ways away, honestly. But at least we got an ally, so that's pretty nice.
We're going to start trying to siege up this guy's stuff here now. We should be actually getting a lot of our own troops back. Yeah, if you, as you can see, we're actually getting quite a few of our, ours back now. And a lot of our own vassals are starting to like us again, which is pretty nice as well. Just took a little bit of time, but, you know, we, it all comes around. Got to siege up a little bit there. No, um, hmm. Oh, I'll take poet. Why not? That's not a bad trait. She's 37 and I'm 42. Hmm. We go ahead and do this seduction. Maybe that might actually work out a little bit better for me. Like how this guy's like always like a step behind. Like, what are you doing? Like, I don't understand that. Like, why is that guy just like sitting there just chilling? Like, ah, oh, don't mind me. I'm just doing this. Repay the loan because we're about to get a ton of it back from winning this war. So. I'm about to just slaughter these guys here in just a second. Nah, we should be able to catch him before. Yeah, we caught him before that happened, so we're good. Alright, that'll be good. Well, we end up getting 540 gold for that, which is awesome. There we go, we cut them off pretty well. We can go back to this province right here. We'll probably be able to siege it up pretty quickly if I had to guess. Yep, there we go. Alright, so we got done with all of our wars. We only lost, we only had to surrender one, which is nice. Okay. Who is this? Kingdom of Navarra. Hmm. Now that's interesting because this guy's actually at a war in a war at the moment, so that's actually not bad. We're actually going to go ahead and take all this guy's stuff here in just a second. So what we're going to sit here and do is we're going to sit here and chill for just a moment and we're going to just slowly slaughter this guy's troops that he's got right here and we're going to let him lose this war over there because to heck with him. Because it doesn't do us any good to actually um, go over there and fight these guys, let them win that war. Let us get our province back that we want, and then we can be happy. We don't need a lot of troops, we just need enough to deal with these guys if they come back. Which I don't know if we will or not, but we'll see. Like, hmm, I hope we had another daughter. It's an illegitimate daughter, but hey, it's a daughter all the same. 
who can I marry you off to for <laughs> for an alliance, I guess? Oh, I guess oh, he's over there in Hungary. Okay, well, whatever. We married in just about everything before too long. It don't matter, I guess. I'm going to let all of this just like kind of merge together here. That's 4,100. That's not bad. Um, what we need now is we need to go ahead and get some uh, commanders and all ready because apparently we're just losing people by the dozens, it seems like, for our court. So just better just to kind of keep this... Uh, up and running as much as possible. Alright, so let's see here. We need the top guy here. Alright. So it looks like this guy is finally like doing his own thing. I think we might actually have a good chance of winning this since we are the ones defending. We didn't, but that's okay. Cause the thing about it is this guy is losing that these wars. Like he's just like losing hard. So I'm exactly not exactly I'm not exactly sure why it is that this guy is actually so focused on me and not focused on the actual war that he is losing extremely hard. Hmm. It's pretty funny actually. Wait for some of our gold to come back a little bit. So we did that. Okay, so this will help us out quite a bit. And then we'll move our guys up here. Does he have allies helping him with this? Oh, he's got those guys helping him. Wow, okay, that makes sense now. That explains quite a little bit now. Man, we have, a, we have so many daughters, but we are not getting any sons at all. The funny thing is, like, none of them are resulting in alliances either. It's just, like, we're marrying them all off, but they're, like, doing nothing for us. <laughs> funny we actually lost that war right there. Wow, okay. Appreciate that, I guess. Well, we're going to be losing a ton of gold if we don't go ahead, so we're just going to have to siege this province up and be done with it, I think. We should have enough troops to just do it pretty quickly. 
And since he's only got one province, we should be able to do it. Like, this should be 100%, I think. Yeah, okay, since he's only got one province left, it's going to give us 100%, so. There we go. I mean, that made life a little bit easier. Okay, we can finally get rid of all this, so that's fine. Alright, so now with that taken care of, can we actually go to war for this guy? Is this guy... Oh, he's actually like... This guy has like no troops either. Okay, that's actually not bad. Okay, so that's a, that should be quite a few right there. Send everyone into this province and just like try to get them to siege this as fast as possible. This little uprising that we like dis disrupted this guy on actually like I think Loki just like helped us out more than anything else. Got a little lucky I think, but I mean you know that's all part of this game. Like it's that's 100% what this is. We're just going to run through here and ransack these guys and just be done with the actual troops that they have. Beat the other, like, little remaining ones. It's actually, like, working out perfectly for us here. Hmm. And I will be happy and take that. Okay, so we can actually lower this, lower this, lower this. Alright, so sweet. I think we might actually have like one like little tiny thing. Oh, we actually have three. Okay. All right, sweet. And that should actually just about wrap this up this episode up. We actually did quite a little bit here. 30 minutes in. We got our um we got actually a little bit more province. We got a few we got an extra province. We actually sorted this out right here. These guys are over here fighting. I don't really care too much about them. These guys eventually will deal with um with 94 I mean with 20 oh, with 2900 troops. We're actually quite we're actually quite a bit stronger than them. Um, and we do have, like, and it's, it's, like, looking, like, up for us as well. Like, we're, we're doing quite well. France is kind of falling apart, and it looks like the, uh, the Muslims are kind of doing, like, their own, like, little thing right now. You can probably actually go to war for Toledo right here, and I think we're going to do that. And we're going to leave the episode here. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please drop a like in the section below. If you want to see more in the future, please subscribe to my channel. It helps out a lot. It means a great deal. And again, guys, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see all of you next time.